Hey everyone on YouTube, I hope you are doing well today. Our topic for today is a filter in Elementor Pro. This feature is exclusive to Elementor Pro and work only with the Loop Builder, which I have taught you about in a previous video. If you have not watched yet, I highly recommend checking it out first. You can find the link in the description below. Without wasting any time, let's get started. Now on dashboard page, we will find the Elementor text and icon. Click here in then a search feature okay after the feature section we found a taxonomy filter here you can see the loads of feature that is uh, available in elementor pro we can uh, working in a flex box we can work in grid we can optimize we can we can do lots of things here okay we can use it nested i have teach you in a previous video if you do not uh, watch it you can watch it okay so we find a taxonomy filter okay it's a disable by default we just active and click on the save changes once activated go to the page where you want to add a taxonomy filter simply click on the elementor and it will become editable okay it's now take time now what i do uh, now we go to a search bar and search here tax a uh, or write a filter you can see that here is a taxonomy filter. You just click here and drag and drop up above the loop builder. Now let's do some setting. We can filter by category or tag. Okay, so we just select firstly uh, in which loop builder we add this filter. And after that taxonomy section, we click on a section and click on the category or tags. Then we can style according to the our previous sense, adjusting thing like a typography, color and size like this is showing like that so we can uh right we can edit according to our requirement so we can add text shadow if you want you can add background you can edit text color etc so you can see that you can design according to your wish now we just updated here now go to the previous changes click here in the icon and then you can now here your filter you can see the multiple ports here if you want to categorize uh, if you can see the two categories in the above section if you click on the wordpress you can see that only show those category which category which uh, category is a wordpress if you click the food you can see a food categories okay uh, that wrap our video today i hope you see in the next one take care